All right, just answering a really quick question. Like somebody had asked me, so how many premium Bibles do you have left after giving away? And remember, I didn't give just to uh, Pastor Brett's ministry. There's people here at the Halfway House, and I started giving out premium Bibles there too, just a couple. But uh, what I have left, this is literally what I have left, which is my my favorite, the readers and uh, <clears throat> navy blue goatskin silver line. Love this Bible. Uh, that's the one I do, baby. And then uh, one that means a lot to me because I came from Pastor Brett. Just uh, and I'm using it like crazy. Saw a video yesterday. That would be my Cambridge Wide Margin, New American Standard, and then Earl Allen, of course, is, uh, New American Standard. This is uh, I might give this one away because I do have a, a reader's hardback. But this is uh, the Heirloom Bible uh, Column Legacy, uh, which I've done a video on in blue goat skin. But I'm Think about keeping it because I don't have you know a premium ESV. I don't read the ESV too often. I do love reading the ESV in a reading format, if that makes sense. Like you know the readers, or the the, the one I have with the Paul's Epistles I just did a review on. I love reading the ESV like that. But I love the in the New American Standard Bible for study and word studies because they're so. Um, it might not be as readable for me. It's pretty easy because I grew you know grew up in King James. But um, it does a wonderful job just sticking to the, the Hebrew and the Greek. The, the more I compare it, the more I see that they're just right on. Did a very, very good job. But those are the premium. That's all I got left, really. All the rest are just pew Bibles that I have sitting there, and a few others maybe I haven't gotten to. I do have some down in uh, New Mexico, but they're like Bibles that are family Bibles. So they're uh, and a few rare ones that are antiques. But that's it. Till next time, good day. God bless.